Yo, what is going on guys? Mobile Care News here and T-Mobile is at it again. They are trying to get people to go on their network, not paying, but testing for free. Um, they haven't done this since 2012 or 2013. I remember they were doing test your uh, test our network for free and it actually was for free. They were testing it. But the but the way they're doing it now is um, so back then in 2012 or 2013, they were testing their network. Um, they had to send you like like one of those boxes, what well, basically one of those routers, and that's the only way you can test it. You had to test it through the the router to see how. It, so you, I mean, you well you, you you could still bring it to places to test their network to get like two bars, full bars, one bars. It was just, um I never tested it myself. I just found that kind of weird. I'm like, okay, I guess that's the only way they can test it. But now they're testing it through an app, which is even much easier for people to test their network. Um, so I get I guess uh, T-Mobile is going coming up with another marketing. They're basically saying they're basically saying have you been curious have you been curious if you want to test the best network speed, the greatest 5G speed. That's what they're basically touting it. They're marketing it like that at the moment. At least with at least with this test drive. I'm surprised they brought it back. I thought this test drive would never come back to be honest, but it did. It's here again. And they're basically saying everyone want to try the best network, the greatest coverage you know how Timo was yada 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 with their with their marketing and whatnot, and this is basically yeah you can test it for thirty days, or they give you two options actually you can test their network you can test it for thirty days if you like it you know just um you know it's it, it's it's free at I don't know if it's free it'll probably come with a catch I don't um I don't obviously I don't need to test the network because I'm already on the network <laughs> so it'd be pointless to test a network that you're already paying for. It just be a waste of time. So you can either they have you give you two options. One you can test it for thirty days to see if you like it or not. You know, a lot of people buy it, a lot of people might not. Or you could choose option B. I believe you. Uh, I don't know how the app works. I believe you can um, pay, uh, choose uh, option B as uh, you can. You can choose thirty gigabytes of data, and and either when the and either when the thirty gigabytes of data runs out, they'll slow down your speed. I don't know what I don't know how it works to be honest. They said we give you thirty gigabytes of data to te to test it. I don't know if they slow it down or they just cancel it, or you have thirty days. Um, yeah, this is what they're basically doing now. Um. Do I think this is a great marketing? Uh, I mean, yeah, it it pretty much is, but um, they're basically they already have what they said. Supposedly or apparently, they have three hundred million customers. They're basically trying to get more, and I see what they're doing here. Um, and and I I am looking. I'm reading through the comments. Um, so T-Mobile actually uh, posted this on their um, on on their YouTube channel uh, on T-Mobile. They posted this. And it's ringing toward the comments, and then people saying, "Yeah, T-Mobile, I love T-Mobile." Nothing, no, like basically, either people, either either regular customers or fanboys. I couldn't tell which ones they were. And then this one cust, and then this one per uh person on YouTube, I believe they said, in the comments, they said, um, I'm trying to remember what they said. I think they said um, they they were they were curious what happens after the thirty gigabytes ends. And yeah, I'm kind of curious too. Like, what does happen after the thirty gigabytes end? But um. Yeah, this is another way to do it. Oh, 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 no. Actually, now I remember what he said. He actually said, he uh, he said, oh, Verizon scared now. And I was just laughing at this comment. And I replied back saying Verizon knows. I, I basically rep replied back saying Verizon knows they're king. I don't think Verizon would be scared of this. Or What do you guys think? Do you think Verizon would be scared of this or not? I personally don't think they'd be scared because, I mean, it's just a test drive. There's like no, there's no, it's, it's like, and if it's actually free, like legitimately free. Verizon is not, Verizon is not making any money off of this. Literally, no money at all. If this is the case, so Verizon is not scared of this at all. It's just a test drive. It's nothing like buy one get one free. Like they're not making any money off this. It's just a test drive. I'm pretty sure Verizon would do the same thing. Would I think Verizon get more customers? Maybe. I honestly don't know. I don't have any stats on any data on that. But this is what T-Mobile is doing to get more customers. Um. I really hope I really hope T-Mobile plans is this. They get more customers, but they actually improve the service. I don't see that happening. That's just what I wish they would do. But it's T-Mobile, and they're not gonna do that. Only they're only investing twelve billion dollars. Anyways, what do you guys think about this? Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Do you think this is a great marketing idea? Will T-Mobile get more customers? 
Let me know in the comments. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe. I'll see you all in the next video.